Good morning, class. Good morning, Headmaster. All right, class. Let's review your assignments while I feign interest. Rupert, how would you use design to make the world a better place? I would invent this stick. To poke a geezer you wouldn't otherwise reach. Ah. Right. Winona, were you equally inspired? Oh yes, sir. I developed a system of modular housing that can be constructed cheaply and efficiently from earth-friendly renewable materials. Each resident will be given a small sustainable farm to nurture and cultivate as means to provide for his or her family. Dignity and self-sufficiency will replace the helplessness and desperation of modern getters. Right. I heard no mention of satellite TV. How do you expect to lure poor people in if there's no tenant? So far, I prefer the stick. Who's next? Eric? Well, sir, my colleague has illustrated there is no cure to the ills plaguing society. So in the light of no solution, I propose distraction. So, without further ado, allow me to present Shiny Monkeys What Dance For Your Pleasure. Regular monkeys painted silver. To a layman, maybe. I've also stuffed them full of enough memory to hold 50,000 songs or 19 hours of pornography. I mean, uncompressed video. Oh, and they scream when you get an email. Oh, brilliant. Are they difficult to use? Well, hey, that's the best bit. Since the shiny monkeys still enjoy free will, you simply sit back and hope they do what you would have otherwise wanted them to do. For instance, I was hoping they would become destructive and enraged. And look at that, they are. Well, there it is then. Functionality accessed through an elegant interface. Eric, you beat the stick. Congratulations, lad. Well, gentlemen, it looks like Robert's me mother's brother. Well, I don't have time to demoralise all of you individually. So let's just say I'm thoroughly disappointed with a lot of you. Disappointed indeed. Now, who wants pudding? Yay! Yay! Boys, stuff some of those unfortunate bastards into the sack and toss them into the boot of my MG. <laughs>